in the year 434, St. Vincent of Lorenz quotes Pope Stephen as proof of the necessity of rejecting all innovation. He writes, For it has always been the case in the church that the more a man is under the influence of religion, so much the more prompt he is to oppose innovations. Examples there are without number, but to be brief, we will take one, and that, in preference to the others, from the apostolic see, so that it may be clearer than day to everyone with how great energy, with how great zeal, with how great eagerness the blessed successors of the apostles have constantly defended the integrity of the religion which they have once received. Pope Stephen of Blessed Memory, Prelate of the Apostolic See, in conjunction indeed with his colleagues, but yet himself the foremost, withstood innovation, thinking it right, I doubt not, that as he exceeded all others in authority of his place, so he should also in the devotion of his faith. In fine, an epistle sent at the time to Africa, he laid down this rule, quote, Let there be no innovation, nothing but what has been handed down, end quote. For that holy and prudent man well knew that true piety admits no other rule than whatsoever things have been faithfully received from our fathers. The same are to be faithfully consigned to our children, and that it is our duty not to lead religion whether we would, but rather to follow religion whither it leads and that it is the part of Christian modesty and gravity not to hand down our own beliefs or observances to those who come after us, but to preserve and keep what we have received from those who went before us.